one step closer today to a seasonal shot against COVID. Medical reporter Liz Bonus explains what that means and who should wait for it. Hey there, everybody. The FDA advisory committee voted 19 to 2 to recommend the use of a new vaccine with what they call an Omicron specific component. Based on the discussion and this 22 page briefing document, it appears most members favor a bivalent or combo vaccine. This means it would have the original vaccine strain plus a vaccine that targets the Omicron strains, probably B4 and B5. Those are the strains right now, the later strains that are dominating. The question, of course, is if you have not had a fourth shot or your second booster, should you wait for this newer vaccine? I think for healthy people, that's not a bad strategy. Um, for those who are immunosuppressed or those who live with immunosuppressed or those who have comorbid, that's not a good strategy and they should go ahead and get the fourth dose. Both Pfizer and Moderna say they need about three months to make this kind of a vaccine and that would put it maybe ready by about October. Since a late fall or winter surge is expected, public health provider Steve Fagans told me this might work much in the way a seasonal flu vaccine does every year. So you are boosting and you are vaccinating. Flu vaccine has three strains usually, and they make them months ahead based on circulating strains. This would be the first step in getting us a yearly COVID-19 or seasonal shot. The FDA would have to approve this strain composition change, by the way, for us to get it. It doesn't have to take the advice of its advisory committee, but it usually does. I'm medical reporter Liz Bonus. Now back to you.